Okay, I'm finally back with another video, painting video, and this one really says a lot about me. <laughs> not how delusional I was at the very beginning. Even now I might be delusional, but like not as much. So while I was looking at my old paintings, I tried to sell them, but it couldn't work. Like it didn't, it didn't work out and now I know why. Like I was so delusional to think people would actually like to buy this. So obviously I have bad memories with it and I have bad paintings as well but like what makes it worse is that I thought that these paintings could be sold and people would actually like to hang it around their house and I was like I need to ask myself this question would you ever hang it anywhere and I was like hell no it's ugly it's mad ugly I was going through these old canvases of mine I saw two thank god nobody bought it or nobody even tried to buy it but also, I still want money, so I wouldn't really be mad if somebody actually liked it, so... Yeah. I have two paintings for this video, and I didn't decide which, like, what am I gonna do with each one, but it has to be something better and I'm good at. I want something simple and cute. And maybe these two will be the one. And actually, I did varnish them, so I really had high hopes. Like, high hopes for these. And these are the two I always thought about with while doing these I had like this time in my life where I was just like I need to do like simple paintings that people hang around their house like this minimalistic stuff but yeah uh, it turns out usually it's like prints so yeah fun. fun with like with, with paint in general and for some reason it's sticky I don't know why it's sticky but it is, so I don't know how many coats and also I don't know how many coats it will take for me to cover it up and these two, like, this one, this color is so strong and the black one here is just... I don't know, maybe I'll cover it in like two coats and just move on and just like cover it with whatever else soon First I started with like the white paint to cover just like a little bit of the f the old painting Didn't really work, it's, it really showed up quite most of it like, point, I didn't know what I was doing, I didn't have any idea of what painting I'm gonna make or what, I, what is the drawing exactly I didn't have any idea, I just wanted to make the video and to remove this painting so I left it there for quite a while, like a week or so Up until I watched The Glory, the K-drama on Netflix And let me tell you, this thing, I binged watched it like in two days or something And I really loved it <laughs> I really, It got me the idea of like the heels and the bottle Like this character killed this character and like the whole thing so I started doing it and actually the sketch looked so satisfying to watch while I sped it up I, I don't know why, this is the first time I was like so satisfied with the sketch uh, With the footage of it So I did enjoy this and I left it there for a while and let me just say I never painted like a bottle before Yeah, I didn't know like where I'm going exactly especially with like the colors also because the heels are like green but like sometimes they appear darker i didn't want it to make make it so dark it doesn't appear green but also it can be like vibrant and the bottle itself is dark too so i had to like make a lot of adjustments and try to figure out how to make the bottle pop without like messing the whole thing up or like making a whole different color both of them like kind of blended together at the beginning and i hated it so I started like looking at the uh, bottle from the scene from the show. It takes some like inspiration from it. Obviously, it's not the same exact one because there's a lot of details in the exact one. So uh, I tried to make it as simple as possible and make it look neat and kind of like resembles the whole thing. So that part took a while actually, and you can see actually in the footage that. I cut a lot of it and some stuff I didn't even film because I was frustrated it didn't really fit together until like I changed some of the colors 
and I, I started to look at like the colors of the shoes, uh, of the heels and like the bottle and it looked like washed out, like it was not saturated enough for me. me Layer of like green and then the other, the bottle thing. I don't know what I even done with it. I can't remember exactly, but it did take a while to look okay and i just look like mm, that's nice but actually i'm kind of impressed with how it turned out honestly in some parts of this like this whole time i was filming i kind of felt dumb while i was filming because you can see mostly i was filming on the floor i had a freaking desk like i have a desk but to me it was like no no, no the floor is better honestly but my back was hurting and i for some reason refused to sit on this except for the last time like I was doing some touch-ups and like detailed stuff which I also didn't film watch me do this like like this is this is the canvas and this is me you can't see shit and most stuff didn't get filmed actually because it wasn't important while I was repainting stuff, especially sometimes on camera you can't even see it. Like, while I was watching the footage, it was showing on camera, which honestly is like my phone's camera, so it's not that even good of a quality. Like, it's not, it's not even iPhone quality, so... I was fixing the bottle a lot because it, it like, gave me some sort of anxiety with it, especially with like the lines outside. Like, the background is gonna be white. I didn't want, I want to color it another or a different color so it doesn't wash out the rest. It wasn't really white white. It has like some pigment in it, but like you get the gist. But yeah, it was not so tough. It was enjoyable actually because I love the show and it did give me inspiration. And also it was interesting to watch after like years of not watching k-drama like it did get me into it again I forgot to film an outro and I lost my voice so here's the painting reveal, it looks good I am shocked now at least I can accept looking at this painting and forget the ugly one, I hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe.